Welcome to another The Word According to Me, DJ Trip. Once again, this is another video that I'm doing where I've taken from my written blog and now put it up on my video blog, my vlog. So this one I wrote Wednesday, November 26, 2014. I bitch, I complain, but I really am thankful. I'm a little over 45 days away from turning 33 years old. And I'm, going, and I'm going to be in my last quarter of school for a degree in graphic design, in which I'm not that good. No girlfriend, no friends, no ways of getting either. A year ago, I was losing weight. But I guess over this summer and fall, I've gained most of it back. Back to being over 300 pounds, 324 to be exact. My life sucks. There is no ifs, ands, or buts about it. It sucks. I wish it could be better, but I don't see how. And I complain to myself about it, and I try to look on the bright side, but there isn't. And there's nothing wrong with me wanting to be different. Wanting it to change. That doesn't mean, however, I'm not thankful for the things that are right in my life. I have a roof over my head, I have food in my stomach, I have clothes on my back. If I wanted to, I could have heat in my apartment. I'm relatively healthy. Both eyes, ears, arms, hands, legs, and feet work fine. And I wasn't buried under 80 feet of snow like the people in Buffalo were. This is during that, that, that Buffalo snowstorm back in 2014. I have so much to be thankful for. And I am. But that doesn't mean my complaints make me ungrateful. Same goes to those out there feeling the same way. Everybody have a safe and happy Thanksgiving. Uh, like I said, I wrote that Wednesday, you know, November um, 26, 2014. That was, I guess that was actually the day before Thanksgiving since it was um, so late. Um, but uh, now let me go ahead and talk about this now. And I think I've talked about this. Uh, in one of the um, prior videos that I've done, I'll put a little gimmick up in the corner so that you can uh, watch that as well. But yeah, I mean, I mean, listen, it's it's um, you know, here we are, 2017, right? And um, I, I I I am 317. I was 317 July 1st. I don't know if I'm get, if I've gained weight if I lost weight. I finally have uh, gotten the key to to the exercise room in the other building that the people in this building can use run, run by the same management so I've, I've gotten that key so I'm going to start using that if not um, tomorrow definitely next week the beginning of next week uh, going over there and working out so I'm hopefully to lose weight um, and it goes again uh, it, it, it kind of goes back to the whole Exotica um, thing I went to this, this this past summer, you know that 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 what that's what made me want to lose weight and what made me want to look more positively at my life and wanted me to kind of go on this you know go on this journey you know of uh, of of enlightenment and and it, it's kind of like. You know, wow! I, I can't believe it, right? Because I, I just, I just thought this way for so long. It's obviously, been a long time since I thought like that, and you know, and yeah, I, I uh, it, it does that because I actually did have to go back to school. I actually did have to go back to school in 2015. Uh, I had, I had to go back to uh, to school to. You know, because I, I didn't wasn't able to find a job coming out of there, and uh, and at, at that point, at that point in time, I, I really wish, you know, I, I you know, I really wish I could have got started on this YouTube YouTube thing a lot earlier, um, but I didn't do that. I want because I, I I didn't think about it because I, I didn't have a laptop. You know, I you know when, when I was living with my uncle, I didn't have a laptop, so and I would go to my mom's house like. To, to clean every other Saturday to get a little money, and um, you know, and, and she obviously she had not she had a laptop. She also had a desktop, and there was a you know I think I think the camera makes to be on there. So 
So, so there was a lot of things that you know you could have, you know, done. I I, I could have done. Could have started. And at one point, I did. I did. I did think about it because if you, if you go back and look at my, you go I'll go all the way back in my in my in my like in my videos, right? You go you know, you know, check my videos and just keep hitting load, load more. There are old videos called the Lord according to me, right? And uh, um, so, and there are, you know, and there are those videos. So I was d doing doing blogs, right? Uploading videos to to YouTube, and you know, I was doing it, but I just did. I didn't. I didn't keep on it, and I didn't keep on it. I was still still thinking about other things, and I was thinking, still thinking about maybe trying to somehow get into broadcasting, and uh, and that's why I thought maybe YouTube would be that way, and then I. I was trying to find other ways because trying to find something else to do because my mom was leaving from Chicago to go to North Carolina and I, I thought and I was trying to find something else There's some something that I could do so that I could take care of myself while you know while she was gone because basically she was still helping me out like I said she would let me come over and pay me for to clean every 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 other week and. So then I went and I did some pharmacy tech stuff, and then once I went through that whole thing and I got the got the, the thing and everything, couldn't find any pharmacy tech jobs, and and you know and and so it's just you know it's just, I just been like in a, in a pool of crap ever since, and then I thought that you know I was going to try to get into graphic design, and I kind of thought that this was my way, this was my way. Right, and then I, when I got into this school, I thought, yes, I got into school. I think that was, I think that was 2013, early 2013. Uh, and I said, yes, this is this is what's going to change my life. This is what's going to do. And for the, and I thought that really, I really did think that for the first, uh, you know, for the first two years, I thought that until I graduated and I, I couldn't get a job, and then I had to go back there, and. And it just went back, back down again. And um, so I, I just, I've always just thought, you know, what the hell, right? But through all, through all of that, through all of that, it, it, from going even back then to now, I have always just been grateful for the things that I do have, you know. Because I, I I could I could be without my sight, my hearing, my you know my my touch, my arms, my legs, my use of things. I, I could I, I could be homeless. I could be you know uh, hungry every every night. I could in every morning. I I could be you know this or that you know and so. There is without question that I am so, so thankful for the stuff that I do have and the stuff that I will always have. I am most thankful for my mother because she has been there supporting me physically, mentally, emotionally, financially, everything. Every, every, every turn I want to do, I want to do broadcasting. Well, I help you. I, I want I want to do Pharmacy tech, well, I help you. I'm gonna go to this school. Well, I help you, and I help you, and I help you. And to this day, I still I help you, I help, help you. Even in fact, today, to get more loans to so that I can continue to go to this school and to live here. You know, she she's co-signing on my loans, and I, I'm racking up thousands and thousands and thousands of dollars of, of student loans, and that if 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 I can't pay or if something happens to me, you know. They go on her, but she's still willing to help, and that's what I'm most thankful for. And it is, you know, so yeah. The, the title says it all. I bitch, I complain, but there's no doubt that I am thankful. You know, I sit up here every day and I, you know, and I, 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 I wonder what, I, you know, you know. You know why? You know why am I up here alone? Why? Why am I not? You know here with you know having a girlfriend. Or why am I not here with like a wife? Or, you know and things like that. And 
you know, and, and, and other things, you know, why, why is this and why is that? And, you know, there, there was another blog that, um, that was, uh, that came before this one, but I decided not to do it because I think it did get, it didn't go into too much, I think, of, of the personal stuff. Um, and it was kind of negative. And, 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 and so, I'm doing these blogs and I'm putting them out on here on YouTube and things like that. But I, I did I did not want to go that far. Um, in, 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 in going too deep. Things like that, but I, I, I think that th this one was a good one because I think this one doesn't have the message of, you know, no matter what the hell is going on in your life, there's always someone who has it out there worse. There's always, there's many people that has it out there worse, and I think I mentioned this again in one of the other videos I, I did that was sort of kind of like this, where I watched that, you know, that, that I, I was looking at myself, I'm fat and I'm ugly and I'm balding and all of this, all of that, you know, and then I look at look, look, look at a YouTube video, and then there's a guy who who gets these things on his face and neck, and they and they just grow and grow, and even when you cut them off, they like seem like they grow and grow back bigger. And I can't, and I just can't imagine, you know, what his life is like, and. So then you have to be thankful, you know, that that's not you, you, you hope he finds a cure and, and, you know, and, 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 and he, and he can, you know, and th that doesn't happen to him anymore and you live a better life, but you have to be single for that yourself, right? And the things that happen to you, so, I think there's, there's always a reason to be thankful for certain things, for the things that you have, even though you may want other things. It's always a reason to be thankful. And, um, trust me, um, sometimes I know it doesn't sound like it, but I am very thankful. Very thankful. Um, so yeah, um, post your comments down below. Let me know what you guys think about this, this topic, but maybe, I don't know, if, I, don't, I don't know if you want to you get into your personal stuff, but it, it, uh, if you can, just know that it's going to help people, um, you know, that that will watch this and they will go down and they will read the comments and you know that there are people out there that like them and, you know, they'll, you know, they'll, they'll be thankful that you you know, you talked about it and things like that. And uh, I, I hope all of you out there are thankful for the stuff that you have. Uh, and, you know, you have every right, just like me, to bitch and complain about the things that go wrong in your life and how life sometimes feels against you and things like that. But if at the end of the day you just realize that even though all that stuff happens, that you are thankful, it's all good. It's all good, baby. It's all good. Like the video, share the video, subscribe to the channel. It'll be down there in the lower left hand corner and a good video for you to watch next is in the upper left hand corner. That will be it for me right now. And this will be it for the water cleaning me for a little while. I have two left. There are um, having to do with sports. So one about the greatest bears that will come before football season. Later on this month or early in September, and then of course, and then I have one for the NBA. Then that will be the last word, according to me, that was posted on my written blog. And then from this now on, all the word according to me will be um, my thoughts and opinions about certain things that have, are happening now, or or that just pop up in my mind or whatever. So you guys will enjoy that. That would be it for me right now. It's Boy AG Trip signing off. As always, be good to each other, y'all. Be careful out there. And I am out.